This is Professor Sparks' art gallery. It's sort of an art museum and an art studio combined. That odd-looking machine over there is his virtual collection, where the professor keeps a display of some of the most famous works of art in the world. You can also go into the painting gallery in the back to create your own masterpiece. Don't forget to bring your imagination. If you're going to visit the gallery, you let me know if you find any of Polly's things hidden in there. If I've told her once, I've told her a thousand times, don't mess up the collection. Of course, she doesn't listen to me. Why, once I found a Romanesque urn next to a Baroque. That's Mrs. Beasley. She's the resident art expert. Some say she's as old as some of the Greco-Roman statues in here. I heard that, you hotshot silicon chipsters. So smart and so fast and so what? I've got more sense in my vacuum tubes than a lot of you. Well, if we have any questions about the art, we'll be sure to ask you. I think Polly has hidden one of the clues in the painting gallery. Click on the gallery way behind me to look into this. This room looks like an ordinary painting gallery, but Polly's father created it so anyone can make their own art. Heidi ho Snotly. I hid one of the mission clues here, and if you want it, either you or your friend will have to paint me a pretty picture. Of course, I get to tell you exactly what to paint. And it better be good. I've always wanted a painting that showed something like this. The astronauts. They have roads on other planets, but the astronauts can fly wherever they want. Click on any of the empty frames to begin painting. Click on the sheet of paper on the floor to read Polly's story. So the deal here is that Polly wants us to illustrate her strange story. I don't have much of an artistic flair. It's just not in my programming. So it looks like it's up to you. Luckily, Professor Spark made it so anyone can paint like one of the great masters. To your left are all the tools you'll need, and at the bottom are lots of cool colors. If you need to be reminded of what Polly's demanding, click on the card on the lower left corner of the frame. When you go back to the gallery, you'll see your work already hanging on the wall. Then we'll find out if Polly likes it. But don't let her opinion matter to you. I don't know much about the artistic process, but my inner transistors tell me that selecting the background first is the best way to illustrate Polly's story. Beautiful job! Just pick up the clue and add it to the inventory! Mm.